the challenger, fighting out of Cherry Hill, New Jersey, and weighing in at 218 pounds. He is wrestling his true headline, Chris and it is time for the Warriors of Wrestling Championship match. The current champion, Sonny Kiss, defending his belt against the former champion, Chris Steeler. This is the one-on-one -on -one match that Steeler wanted. He's finally getting it. His last championship opportunity was a triple threat match. Now Steeler's got Sonny Kiss where he wants him, a one-on-one -on -one contest. It's one-on-one, -on -one. mano in mano, Chris Steeler gets his rematch with Sonny Kiss. The winner of this contest will be the Warriors of Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion. Who's your pick on this one? Uh, I, both of these competitors are very impressive. What sound was that? Wow. Oh, uh, uh, I, listen. I think it's anyone. I think if Chris was saying it's, I think either it's, 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 it's either or here. Well, Steeler is much more aggressive, as you can see right now. I think uh, Sonny Kiss, though, has the advantage when it comes to athleticism. He's a former cheerleader. Very, very nice background. Um, he's very athletic. He can jump all around the ring. Sonny Kiss has been wrestling all over the place. Future AEW star. Head scissor takedown, sending down Steeler, rolling out of the ring. Current Lucha Underground star is that performing under the Lucha Exolicious. But right now, tonight, in Brooklyn, at Warriors of Wrestling, he is your reigning and defending Warriors of Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion. Chris Steeler says otherwise. And, not, and you know what? He, he really, he deserves it. He deserves that title. He, he's wrestling for a long time. He's won a No Limits belt, and he's really made a name for himself. Now, he's got the most coveted prize here in Warriors of Wrestling. But Steeler wants it back badly. Sending Steeler out of the ring. A nice clothesline by Sonny Kiss. Chris Steeler is going to need to remain in the ring if he wants to come out on top on this one. Kiss looking a lot more aggressive than he normally does. He does not have any appreciation for Steeler, but still, Kiss was respectful. He did extend his hand before the match started to Steeler. He's a noble champion. Right now, all Steeler cares about himself and only himself and only his chances at becoming a multi-time Warriors of Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion. Sonny Kiss, he's extending the ropes, trying to let Steeler in. I would not trust Steeler, but he is. Steeler doesn't know exactly how to play oh, that. Quick high knee, sending down Kiss, rolling out, and look at the disrespect by Steeler. Steeler quickly taking advantage of the situation. Sonny Kiss was just trying to be a nice guy, but sometimes nice guys don't hold on to the belt. Oof. That's going to leave a mark. Sonny Kiss's head crashing down on the most not giving part of the ring. A professional wrestling ring has very little give, contrary to any belief, and that apron has the least of any give. It is just solid wood. There is no padding. Pinfall, just a two count. There is, it is solid wood. There is no padding. There is nothing but the canvas and wood. And that is about it. Steeler going for a suplex. Landed perfectly. 
Steeler insists that he's the man. The crowd doesn't really want to have any of it. The crowd is behind Sonny Kiss. They're not behind Steeler at all. But Steeler here is really mocking the champion at this point. In the middle of the ring, Steeler setting up Kiss, but Kiss evading danger and now offering some forearm strikes. This is that one picked up. Ooh, reverse atomic drop. Well, actually, that's actually an atomic drop. Excuse me. Big boot to the head, and Kiss goes down. Steeler feels like this is all she Going for the pin on the future AEW star and champion. Kiss kicking out, kicking out again. Just a two count, Chris. For submission hold here. Now the champion taps out. The title changes hands. Stuck in the middle of the ring. Sonny Kiss has to make some, something happen quickly. Sonny Kiss is right on his feet. Chris Dealer is trying to cut off that air supply. He's trying to make it so that Sonny Kiss can't breathe and has no wind. That extension on that leg is attributed to the cheerleading background that Sonny Kiss has. As mentioned before, he's very, very athletic. You see him do some flippy stuff around the ring. Come on, Steeler, get him out of there. Come on. What's this? Steeler thrusting that shoulder into the abdomen. Now Sonny Kiss is now seated on that middle turnbuckle. Steeler having a very methodical approach here, taking his time and being very calculated and attacking Kiss. There's a clothesline. He's going to go for another pin. One, two, Kiss kicking out again. And that's the heart and the will of a fighting champion that is Sonny Kiss. Sonny Kiss is not going to leave his shoulders to the mat so easily. If you're Chris Steele, you got to be thinking, what else do I got to do to leave Brooklyn as the new champion tonight? I think one of the things Steele has to do is not even mind the crowd. He's playing to the crowd way too much. He's attacking them, and he's getting distracted from the task at hand here. Sonny Kiss is no slug. Kiss crawling to the bottom turnbuckle, trying to get back to his feet. Steeler helps him up, but not in a friendly way. Picking up Kiss and sending him down with a scoop slam. Sonny Kiss, as you can hear, has the support of the Warrior Nation here. Oh, yes. Sonny's one of the most beloved superstars here in Warriors of Wrestling history. Climbing to the top of the turnbuckle is Steeler. You don't see this often. Going for high impact. He misses and lands with no success of hitting Kiss. Landing where the sun does not shine. You are going to feel that in the morning, the next week, the next month, if you are Chris Steeler. And this is a window of opportunity for Sonny Kiss using those legs to strike Steeler. A baseball slide underneath. Nice drop salt there. Another strike. A high flying, innovative offense of Sonny Kiss. A split and tripping up Steeler. You don't see that from many competitors, folks. In fact, he may be the only competitor you see that from. Moonsong. Standing one. There's the pin. Just the two count. And that's vintage Sonny Kiss. Sonny Kiss thought he might have had it, but you're going to have to do a little bit more if you want to put away Chris Steeler. Chris Steeler, there are no timeouts in professional wrestling. There's no timeouts, Mr. Steeler. Here comes Sonny Kiss. A cheerleading background. Playing well there, and there's a disrespectful slap. Only disrespect that was given by Chris uh -oh. Hold on. We've seen this before, but Steeler knows it's coming. Invades danger, but gets hit with a high kick, and he's down to the mat. Sonny Kiss sees an opportunity, but Steeler's up. He doesn't realize it. Ooh, Sonny Kiss' head crashed down to the top. Trevor goes, spear by Steeler. A spear by Steeler. This could be it. Two championship on the line, but... Kiss kicks out. Sonny Kiss was just able to get his shoulder off the mat just before the three count. A split second later, Chris, we a see a new champion. Wait a second. Tuning up the van is Chris Taylor trying to capture another Warriors of Wrestling Heavyweight Championship. Kiss slow to his feet. He's up, turns around. Super kick is missed. Sonny Kiss with that spinning kick. Nice move. Sending down Steeler. Steeler is down. Steeler is down. Kiss with an opportunity here. Steeler doesn't know where he is. He's stuck in the middle of the ring. Kiss on the middle rope with that split leg drop. He hits it. 
and it's enough.